Good morning. It's really early in the morning. But something came to me in the middle of the night. I was trying to decide how was I going to fit um, my new corner piece up in that corner. So this white wall is the back. Well, I mean, they're both white, but the, the shadow makes it look different. And I have this angled piece coming down, right? So you know what I'm saying? Like, if you're looking back at this wall, there's the, there's the ceiling, but this the, the side wall has this angled piece, which is really cool. I like it a lot. But how is that going to fit this up there and make sure that I fit it in correctly? Because, you know, I, I, want, it, I want it to fit right up in there. And I'm really not good with measurements. Like, I'm not not good. I'm horrible. I measure five times and then cut once and I'm still wrong. And then, guess what I thought of? I thought, wait, I know what I can do. I can just um, put a piece of paper behind it. And like I'll just tape it to the back of it. And my hair is going on wonky. I can just put a piece of paper to the to the back of it. And then you know, that way I don't actually cut the the final thing. I can try it over and over and over again until it fits just right. Yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do this morning. Oh my gosh, it just occurred to me. I bet that we cut from the corner down to the middle. <laughs> of course we do. I feel so stupid right now. <laughs> but you know, um, I remember one time when I was asking my mom something like, whatever, it didn't work because of some, I did something like that. And she goes, well, we live in an imperfect world. I have discovered that whenever I'm doing things around the house, construction-wise, walls are so rarely perfect. But we're gonna try, we're gonna try it with this piece of paper and see if this wall, this corner might be right in that way because, yeah, walls are rarely ever like 90 degrees and things like that, but we're gonna try it. I don't feel so stupid anymore because look, it's not true because I didn't account for the part that goes in towards the wall. See, look. I'm gonna have to do something about that. No, I just have to have, I just have to have it go further out. See, I wasn't wrong, I wasn't wrong after all. I have to have the top part come further out. Yeah. Yeah, so I wasn't wrong in trying. Yay, 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 yay. Okay, I'm glad I did it this way then. Okay, so good news, I'm up here again. I'm gonna try this again, but I'm just gonna eyeball it, really. I know this sounds terrible, but I'm pretty good at eyeballing better than even measuring. So when I look at this, I see that it's gonna be Oops, my pencil's in the way. I can't hold both. Well, I I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna eyeball it, and we're gonna see if it's gonna work, okay? Oh, <laughs> pretty darn good. Look, 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 look. Okay, third time's gonna be a charm. Third time's gonna be a heckin' charm. That's really not bad. <laughs> it just occurred to me. It needed to be curved. <sighs> so, yeah. Ding! I got it to because <coughs> It's not gonna be a straight line because it's not a, it's a curved, <laughs> curved swords. They had curved 
swords. And if you get that, then you're a true nerd. And I love you. And ta-da! 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 Dun, 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 dun. It worked out great. So I guess I'll start, I'm gonna start filling in. Well, I kinda like to, um, well, where is it? Bevel the edge, because it's kinda thick. Bevel that a bit, and then start filling in the gaps of the, see how there's like, um, ridges in the roll. <laughs> ridges, ridges, ridges. Uh, fill in the ridges and that sort of stuff with joint compound, more joint compound. I thought I was through with that. Oh, this project. But it's gonna be cool when it's over, right? But yeah, we got that part done. I was really nervous and now it's done.